Well, I went to Dalhousie University in Halifax, Nova Scotia as an undergraduate from 1963 to 1967. And Dalhousie had then and still does an excellent psychology department. We were required to take labs with each of our courses in psychology other than Psych 100. And I quickly developed a passion for doing research. I caught the attention of one of the professors and I became, I believe, the very first undergrad to become a research assistant in psychology. Usually that honor goes to grad students, but here I was as an undergraduate. And the professor, Dr. H.D. Beach, no one dared call a professor uh, by his or her first name in those days. Uh, Dr. Beach was a clinical psychology, a psychologist in the area of cognitive behavior mod. And he involved me not only in his research, but in working with some of his clients. And one day he asked me for my advice with regard to one of the clients. Now this is way back in 64 or so, or 65, or I would never have the nerve to repeat this embarrassing story about me. But my answer to him was, Dr. Beach, I drowned the guy in the Halifax Harbor. Well, a day later, he never got mad, never said a word, but a day later in his laboratory on my desk, was an article by Brayfield and Crockett. It's a seminal article on the relationship of job performance and job satisfaction. I read the article, went racing into Dr. Beach's office. I said, Dr. Beach, I want to become an industrial organizational psychologist. And he sat me down and talked to me for a few minutes and the rest is history. <laughs> <laughs>